The infamous M Town on the 13th. This is where I am right now. Damn, this is a sad one. This is a photo of Sean Craig. He actually followed my channel and was a fan. Friends and family told me that I actually interviewed him back in the Sister Ring Festival. Long live Stick, man. Long live Stick forever, man. Hey, long live my brother. That was the only brother I had. You know what I'm saying? Long but I didn't know that he was the one that was killed in Fort Lauderdale, M Town. Well, now I'm here and I can see a dead body, yellow tarp over it, lots of crime scene tape, Fort Lauderdale police everywhere. Back on March the 7th, literally a week later, he was killed. It's a sad one. Friends and family told me that they believe he was killed because of possibly some opposition, some other people that didn't like him for personal reasons, they might have retaliated against him. So in Fort Lauderdale, that hard to, pron that hard to pronounce name, that Chate Park Drive, March 7th, about 9.30 p.m., Rashawn was somewhere there and he was killed. His body laying there, yellow tarp, next to that truck. Here you can see a flyer of the Crime Stoppers saying that they will pay $5,000. Anybody with information leading to the arrest of the suspects responsible for this killing. Now, I don't know the reason why he was killed. Don't ask me yet. That's still under investigation. But this is a small update, just trying to tell you guys who was killed here. As I'm doing more to get updates on this information, this story here, but it's not easy to do so. Again, he was killed on March 7th, 9.30 that night. So it's hard to see whose suspects were responsible. Again, no one really knows anything, so police are asking for those who know something. Step forward. Terrible, I hate covering the death of my fans. It's the worst, especially being so young. Rest in peace, Rashawn. Stay safe, be careful. Seriously, it's a dangerous world, and you can only do so much to stay alive. Reporting in Fort Lauderdale, Broward County, the breaking news reporter. Protect yourselves, watch your backs. Remember, it's a war zone out here. Breaking news reporter, trying to do my best to keep you guys updated. I'm sorry I can't provide you any more details. It's the best I can do for you. Be safe. See you in the next scene.